I'm Lone, and welcome to the final episode of Darkwood Hard Mode Mod. <laughs> we made it through the evening. We're actually going to go take a look at the tree location. Because I think there's about like three people or so standing around over there. At least I believe that's the case. So we'll have to go see them before we finally go to the radio tower. Um, <laughs> There's a dream sequence when you get to the radio tower that I'm slightly concerned about. I mean, if you fail it, that doesn't necessarily mean you fail to get into the epilogue. But uh, it's, it's a little difficult and tricky, and we're going to have to be very uh, uh, pro proactive. And uh, I'm going to have to remember some stuff <laughs> that it's been a while since I've done. So hopefully it all goes well. But for now, let's run over to the tree. Then we're running back to the holes and hitting the radio tower, taking a look around. See if we can find any more um, information. Uh, there should be an update to what's up with the snail and where he ended up. Mm-hmm. Kind of excited for that, too. And hopefully none of the enemies respond. But if they have, we'll take care of them. Don't have my boots on. Need to be a little bit careful about that. So, yeah, we'll be careful. I think we can go this way. I don't usually go that way, but looks like we have a way through. Oh, you can dig through the rubble. Interesting. I don't think I've been over here. <laughs> oh, God. We're going to run into a bunch of stuff I haven't done. And then... Uh, shit. <laughs> Hole. Scrap metal. Okay. I don't have a way of repairing our thing, so <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, we didn't go over here. Uh-oh. <laughs> Maybe this won't be the final episode. There's still more to do. I'd kind of be okay with that. Honestly, if this game just like lived in perpetuity and there were constant updates to it, I would play it till the end of time, most likely. That would be kind of fun. And I'd be kind of okay with it. Okay, that didn't really go as planned, but... Oh, don't. Oh, I didn't have to do that. Shit. I forgot. He has a health. Oh, he didn't have that. Usually they have the mushroom infested meat. That's kind of weird, right? Huh. Wonder what's up with that. What did I come across? There is something there. Oh, wooden door. Oh, okay. I see. Oh, uh, the word thieves has been scrolled again. On the floor. Swamper. Come on, buddy. Over here. Okay. There we go. I think we have enough room to do this little dance. Do a little dance. Hit you with the shovel. Make love tonight. Well, probably not that part of it. But I will dance with you. No love making with Swampers, please. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. Yeah. Useless after firing, of course. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff up here. Interesting. Oh, and there's a chest in there. That's probably the chest with the, uh, we already opened the lottery ticket chest, but. Let's see what's in it. Oh, okay. Oh, there's actually a map location for the burned cottage. Ah, burned cottage. So it is there, but maybe you have to identify it before. Before actually being able to go there? Interesting. I tried to check it out before, but there was nothing there. So, I don't know. Maybe we could take a look at it again. <laughs> and have one more episode. That would end the series. 
that would end the series on episode 40 that would be kind of good i don't i don't really mind that it might be okay could like live through one more night it's a good round number yeah probably what i'm gonna do oh man what a tease I'm not going to redo the intro. <laughs> we'll keep it the same. Subverting expectations is the uh, the, the spice of life. How about that? Hmm. <laughs> journal entry. Ashes. Here, let's take a look. I've finally gotten out of the tunnels. The hatch has sealed itself shut behind me. Oh, no. <laughs> That's like way earlier. Yeah, okay, cool. So, ashes. It worked. Only ashes remain. Oh, it's for the tree. I feel I'm approaching the end of my journey. It, is it possible? I mean, it is. But we're not going to go all the way in. Yeah, the old man's right down here, right? Or at least he used to be... No, he's usually right here, but it looks like he took off. So, which actually makes sense. Right, I think we got everything locked down here in the uh, in the village now. But yeah, there's the tree. Can't see much. Hmm. I thought the three were here, but I think maybe they show up randomly when the tree is alive. And I don't know what... I, I think maybe that... I don't know if the people who are melded to the tree are actually people or if they're copies. So it would kind of make sense that certain people sort of like not revere the tree i guess that's the wrong word for it but um like the three wanting to keep the the tree like alive and visit it maybe because their relatives are in there you know at least some of them like their father or something um i think that's a possibility or it could be just a worshiping kind of thing because they did adorn themselves with you know like robes and cowbells and things like that so um, I don't know what significance they necessarily hold, but uh, but yeah, that would kind of make kind of make sense in that regard. Oh, mushroom man! Nope, searched already. All right, all right. Well, let's go up. Yeah, we can go to the burnt cottage. Mm, we don't have any way of repairing our stuff now, so. It's going to be a little difficult to do a little bit of inventory management first. Um, we do have Molotov cocktails, so should be good on that front. Um, we can pop the shotgun there. We've got two shotguns left, or shotgun shells left back at the house. We've got about four, ten, nine, eight, seven. Yeah, probably like seven shots in our rifle left too. So if we come across anything awful that needs putting down. We can do that. But yeah, our shovel's probably going to be toast here in a little bit. Is it this right here? Unless we've been here before. All right, let's grab that military flashlight again. Or is this like more of the village? Yeah, it doesn't, it's not highlighted. So yeah, we're not quite there yet. This looks like just another kind of random location. Oh, underwater corridor. So that'll get us to the burn cottage. Okay. Yeah, we can go back home and grab the oxygen tank real quick. We got some time. 
It'd be good to get the last little bit of this wrapped up. Uh, I've got some stam stuff, so I might as well use it. Yeah, I don't think we can we can repair any of our weapons, unfortunately. So maybe there'll be some medium caliber magazines laying around somewhere. I'm not exactly sure though if we have them or not. Um, oxygen tank right there. And uh here, let's look real quick. I mean everything seems kinda quiet, so it should be shouldn't be too difficult. Uh where's our shotgun? Single shot shotgun. And then our shotgun shells. There we go. Okay. We'll equip that instead for now. Gas bottles stay on us. Could probably put away a couple lanterns. Uh, repair? Yeah, no. Mm -mm. No tape. <laughs> well, maybe we'll find some tape. It could be, could be helpful. Oh yeah, we do have a lockpick on us, so got to remember that. Keep the single shot around too. Should be good. All right. Yeah, that shovel's a little bit better condition. It's not going to hit very hard, and it's going to get toasted pretty quickly, but flare bottle knife, torch, small caliber magazines. Yeah, we don't got nothing. Nothing. Coffee. Coffee. Yeah, let's see what's in there. There you <laughs> made me jump. <laughs> Dickhead. Oh, <gasps> here we go. An old simple wooden cross covered in inscriptions. I can still decipher one of them. May you never know hunger again. I feel more comfortable with that on our hotbar. Probably a lantern too. Some skeletons have been pushed into the water and are now lying in the mud. And time's still moving, so just have to be mindful of that. It's all blocked off. Very overgrown back here. Cottage has been burned to the ground. Probably shouldn't sprint just in case. So definitely the village. Um, not sure. 
who these people are. Looks like there's a f couple of fires in the distance. Those don't look like... Maybe it's like a bonfire or something. Doesn't necessarily look out of control. But yeah, it looks like just a bunch of people with packs on. Walking down a road. Even migrating to a different area. I'm not exactly sure. Oh, somebody's in here. Saw the wardrobe move. And another photo. Oh, okay. So, yeah, it was a fire. Maybe the people were leaving because of the fire? I'm trying to think of any instances in the lore, aside from us burning the tree, where there was fire. We've, we've heard about the the light, the anomaly, um, and then the flooding that happened, and then the overgrowth of trees. Those are all, like, natural disasters. Um... The burned house from uh, the Dry Meadows, that's one of them. Could be that, or it could be this cottage. Mm. No, I suppose it wouldn't be this cottage. That doesn't make any sense, because <laughs> there's a photo of it in the cottage. So, I mean, unless they came here after it burnt down, I suppose that could be an option as well. But, um, trend, I mean, also the instance of a helicopter was it probably wasn't the doctor's wife that was on board it was probably like a target or something like those people had a photo of somebody they were supposed to grab or get or pick up possibly but it could be that same helicopter that crashed yeah i don't know I'm not sure. All right, we got to fucking blast our ass <laughs> back home. <laughs> it's going to be a rough night. I'm probably going to die. Hey, buddy. You know what? Yeah, we're probably going to die. Third eye. No, wrong button. <laughs> okay, we barely made it out. We're not gonna have a lot of health. Uh, pills. That was bad. I totally for I thought we were in a dream sequence. It felt like a dream sequence. So it was like, I don't have access to my skills for some reason. That's okay. I don't wonder. I think we've looted that chest. Probably, definitely. Here, eat that before it goes bad. All right, we have two alcohol bottles, so I think we'll be fine. We should be just fine. Yeah, man. Just when you think Darkwood doesn't have any juice left that you can squeeze. Go exploring a little bit. It's there's squeeze there. Uh, wood. We do have that though. You know, let's just do it old fashioned here. Let's see. Kind of running out of nails though. Hmm. And boards. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, bandage on hot bar. You will use you tonight. Assault rifles. Toast. Have no ammos left. Uh, military flashlight can stay here. We're actually gonna get another one from the radio tower. Um, hop our stuff we can do after. 
Guess you go on the ground. And batteries go on the ground. Alright. Yeah, we can barricade this. Barricade the, uh... The door. Nope. Cannot. Damn. What do we have left? Chameleon and Scream. It's actually not bad. Oh, there might be some nails on the ground. Yep. 50. Oh, shit. There we go. But... Oh, no. We got it. Cool. That'll help a little bit. Bird. Uh, shovel's still okay. So that's good. Uh, what was I going to do? Oh, yeah. Actually. We've got you. Keep forgetting to use you. Mmm. <laughs> I hope that lasts. We'll just put you... Everybody always comes in this door. This... This way. So... I don't know, man. Hopefully the light holds up. We'll see. We've got a lantern on us, so. We should be generally okay. Is there another one in here? Dude, I have that stupid I Am Rectangular song stuck in my head for days now. I don't even know where I heard it from. <laughs> I hate it so much. I just hate it. Gas bottle and flare. Even though we probably don't need flares. Yeah, I probably don't need flares on our heart bar. Could just be a doggy night, please. Yeah, sorry about the misleading intro. I didn't realize there was more stuff to kind of piece together. I mean, we still got a couple of... There's no major map markers over here. So it's probably all just going to be other ruins. There's like six ruins or so. Old shed, ruin, ruin. Yeah, there's a few of them. We haven't visited every single one. And some are larger than others. Yep, the exact window. Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh, okay. That works. Oh, just another dog. Hey there, buddy. There he is. He just wanted to bust. He did that pretty quickly. <laughs> what a nerd. Today, bugs. I'm trying to think of how long the chameleon lasts. It does last a pretty long time. It's too quiet. I don't like it. <laughs> it's gonna be centipedes.
Oh, it's going to be human spiders. Oh, that did nothing. Oh, how could you miss? How could you? How dare? Uh, bandage, please. It's not going to heal us all the way, but... Nope. Not even gonna fight. Look, my hands are off. <laughs> I'm not even touching the mouse. Hopefully. Oh yeah, we're fine. There's a little hug box in the corner. <laughs> You've got plenty of arms for it. We're gonna snap out of it any second though. No! <laughs> I didn't re- I didn't reload. Oh, I don't have- uh, you can't reload that one. I think that's like a double shot. Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> Useless after fired? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I, that was- They look the same except for- Well, you can clearly see that that one has two barrels. That's okay. I wanted to blow them up with the canister, but just didn't work out that way. But that's okay. All right, well, we're kind of in rough shape, so we definitely have to end this on the next episode. All right, sorry again <laughs> for the intro. <laughs> intro is totally misleading, but uh, I'll address it probably in the in the title, so you all will know beforehand that this is not the final episode. Episode forty will be the final episode where we go to the radio tower and probably die during the dream sequence and be sad. Mhm, mm probably. But that was cool. I had fun. Got a little bit more lore out of the D-Wood. Yeah, I'm glad we went there. I, I'm really excited to go through and read just the whole story explanation for the game. And then I'll probably do like a final playthrough of it once I'm like knowledgeable of all the lore. So I'll be able to explain everything correctly as we play through. And like... um. In what the what the sequence of events were leading up to and during uh, all the events in Darkwood. But that will be for another time. All right. We will leave it there. Episode 39. Darkwood Hard Mode Bomb. Done. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm Lone. And this, don't do it, has been Darkwood.